Employees of the independent television network staged a protest for the third consecutive day today. The protests launched by the employees of ITN continued till this evening. The employees are protesting against the political appointments of the network's managerial staff and the massive financial irregularities that allegedly took place at the ITN in the past. In a letter addressed to the president, the employees of ITN stated that 677 million rupees in a fixed deposit of the ITN had been withdrawn for use during the past three years. The protesters charged that the management has taken steps to suspend 13 employees of the ITN who were involved in the protests. Our brothers who are engaged in this struggle have not at any instance caused damage to the property here. They have not violated discipline. It is in such a backdrop that 13 employees have been suspended. The chairperson is threatening that she will terminate the employment of the remaining 300 as well. Our final request is for a solution to be provided to this before all of that happens. Currently by creating a financial crisis here, they are trying to sell off the independent television network to someone else. If you can throw out all 800 who are here and sell this off, that can't be done.